Hi friends, welcome to testing tutorials point. This is Lokesh and today we are going to discussing about our first test case creation using our Cucumber framework. Okay, and I updated uh, yesterday also in the today morning also it uh, updated but uh, unfortunately that uh, particular video don't have a voice. I don't know what happened in that even I check the settings and everything but uh, still I'm not able to uh, replicate that into voice into that already updated video for due to that I again I'm waiting for another video to the first video updation okay and I will uh, remove that into YouTube channel and I will re-update this video okay already presented i'm going to do for first demo okay this is the one we have to create the first okay once you create it and like uh, whenever you created this because it will not be implemented here okay it will not be there and we have to remove i'll remove these all the things nonsense and I'll remove this also. Okay, I'll freshly I'll show you. Okay, once we create a like this, and we have to see uh, there is no information about here, but I'll uh, create here is a sample code which is future, and a future is a login functionality. And then I'm going to create for the scenario. And here there are a couple of things will be there. Okay. Scenario and scenario outline. Main we are going to take that a scenario. And next video session times we can able to see for scenario outline also. How exactly we can able to create scenario outline. Okay. For here I'm going to create the scenario. For the scenario with the valid username. And password okay and here given I'm going to provide the given <coughs> open browser and when condition I'm going to make in for my action that called as providing valid username and password and then I'm going to verifying that verifying home page. Okay, this is a functionality I'm going to create. It. For what application we are going to take it for this? I'm going to take for this particular demo application, new tools. Okay, and here I'm going to make it for login functionality for new tools application. This is my feature okay and here i am going to provide for login valid user but still i am not implemented for my functionality because we just this is the words we can able to like any member can able to understand okay this is the functionality you are going to implement in your call level they can able to understand now even non-technical member also can able to understand this is a simple language okay the given place he doing for opening the browser Okay, here he is providing for a valid username and password and then he is verifying the home page like a simple words and you no need for the code functionality how you are going to implement your code. But he want to see that what exactly you've done that. Now this is the one but still we are not implemented our steps. Okay, if you run here by using here by PyTest we are using for PyTest. In Python file, we are using for Python, right? It's a similar format we are using for behave. For this, we need to use for behave itself. Behave. Space. And we need to use for futures. That is a folder name. Slash. And we need to use for first demo one dot future. And enter. See, it is asking. Uh, there is a naming convention also wrong. See, it is still it is asking for step definition directory is not present. You have to implement step definition. Then take the steps. Okay, the name you can able to copy, 
and you can able to create inside the future that's also a problem or you can able to create the directory of the file okay here you can able to create the directory steps i just I create the steps now you can see the difference how it will be there now it is provided previous it is not provided for the steps and now it is provided for the steps okay all the steps it will provide here what all the okay and we will step on now here it is not provided given open browser okay sometimes it will behave like this in case if it is something it's like a, uh, some history or something it is, it is storing it is showing like this okay just how you can able to implement just i'm going to take the these two remaining two or else we can able to directly also create our own way okay how we can able to create our own way means just i'm going to create the python file that is a login underscore methods okay i'm just a creator for that implementation purpose okay and now what is the method for ours that is a given okay before given and all we need to import our functionality then for that i am going to use for behave import and okay i am going to use for given because i am going to use for given functionality okay this is a open browser just to copy the name and you can able to come to here use it for at the rate a given sorry given and then open the braces and single quotation paste it into your value okay then after that you can you able to use for def and provide for the name of that like open open browser and inside the uh, browser basically on a python uh, function if you are going to create by using the class functionality that moment we are going to use for self as a keyword right here there is no self but we can able to use for context 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 is the key we can able to reuse our code into any place okay and this is a functionality which we can create and next one is when <coughs> For the when again we need to import in the top position that is called a comma when okay and we have then also then we need to use for then also okay and again at the rate symbol when and again you use for single quotation and provide the value and create the function that is called valid username and password. And again, we need to use for context. Why this context will help you? I'll show you. Okay. Wait a couple of minutes and I'll show you that. Single quotation. Verifying home page. And again, create the function that is called verify underscore home and context colon okay and we are very far see now we are using one import and we are providing all the comma comma for doing this we can able to use for star symbol if you use a star symbol also it will provide the same okay after that we need to import for our selenium driver from selenium import web driver <laughs> Now opening browser place we have to use for opening our driver web driver dot chrome <coughs> now if you want to now if you want to access this particular driver into this particular location means you have to do it like context dot driver what context dot driver can do right it will work like a self it will work like a self how we are going to create that uh, selenium function with the using of self keyword 
when you use the self keyword you can able to replicate into on all the places right and you can able to use the same same name without uh, any impact the same number format this context will say that this particular function and this particular function is using for same object reference you can able to use it in runtime like that okay then we need to use for uh, from selenium web driver and common input dot up by input up by okay we need to import the by also right and here i can able to provide for <coughs> context dot a driver dot a get function and here is the my url this is my url i'm going to paste in here okay then we need to use it here context dot a driver dot a find element find element underscore element and we need to use for by dot name because this particular application having name functionality okay if you inspect here it's a username and just we pass the username and i'm going to use for send underscore keys and here i'm going to use it for mercury this is username okay then i'm going to use for again context dot a driver dot a find element again i'm going to use for by dot name and this is called password i think this is a password just copying password and i'm using for here send underscore keys again same value which is at the top we pasted right the same one okay then we need to use it for to clicking for the submit button context dot a driver dot a find element a by by dot name value and the functionality is click okay and then once it is completed we have to do it like a uh, assertion or we can able to print the value okay anything we can able to do it if i go to provide for valid username and password here if i submit here then my application become different the location is different and also your title of the page also different we can able to say login mercury tours is there and we can able to do it and we can able to use the assert this value is equal to equal to context dot driver dot title if it is equal then you can pass it like that we are specifying okay now our functionality is ready okay and we can able to run this particular functionality and we can able to see whether we are able to run our uh, test case or not okay for the terminal again i'm going to run for the same we are going to run for particular future file not for step definition not anything because we are going to run for our first test case which is related to that future file and if you run now you can see the browser is open mercury to rules and it is provided and lag and validation and even you can able to see now it will provide for the result whether it is passed or not see one scenario and three steps are passed okay three steps are passed and zero failures and zero skipped and defined also zero this is a very simple way we can able to update and we can able to do it for our first test case creation by using for behave python okay i hope it this particular video will help you and sorry i'm one more time because i 
I don't know why it is missed out the voice on the previous video. I'll make it for now. Okay. Thank you. Please subscribe my YouTube channel. Don't forget to share your friends and colleagues. Thank you.